Ric Flair versus HBK at Bad Blood. The following contest is scheduled for no, one no. Ball. Introducing first, from Charlotte, North Carolina, weighing in at 234 pounds, the Nature Boy, Rick Flair. People ask, who do you think is the greatest champion of all time? To me, it's a toss-up. It's either Ric Flair or Shawn Michaels. Flair dominated the 80s, as no one has ever dominated a decade. Shawn Michaels dominated the 90s. It took what Flair had done to another level. Well, there have been a lot of guys who wanted to be like Ric Flair. La la. All right, so this is going to be Flair versus HBK the first time. The next time was the retirement match. And that was a long time later, I think. A few years later. And from San Antonio, Texas, the heartbreak kid, Shawn Michaels. From just down the road in San Antonio, Shawn Michaels has paid his way here to Houston. Well, like you said it before, Cole, nobody dominated the 80s like Nate, Rick Flair. And nobody dominated the 90s like Shawn Michaels. But you know what? This is 2003. Who's going to dominate tonight? Yeah, too bad that whole thing's complete bullshit because it was Hulk Hogan who dominated the 80s, not Ric Flair. Ric Flair dominated everywhere Hogan wasn't, but Hogan dominated the top cards. Back to the last 20 years and some of the greatest five-star matches and match of the year candidates. And one common denominator is that they usually had either Ric Flair or Shawn Michaels in them. And that's why this match is almost guaranteed to be special. I love it. The Texas crowd does too, King. The cheers for HBK already starting up from his home state Bullshit. Fans. But you can hear that Flair has his cult following too, as always. He's putting those educated feet to good use. You know, Rick Flair. Oh. To get Shawn Michaels <laughs> into the corner. As Flair, the old man. I love that the old man Flair in this game. Speed advantage as much as possible. The but flopping even Flair, Flair is giving up an edge in quickness. The Nature Boy is still one of the most proficient athletes I've ever seen. Rick Flair is not someone to sleep on. Oh. He just planted him with a DDT. You know, Shawn Michaels might be as athletic a superstar as we have oh in WWE today. Oh, my balls. The one thing to watch out for in a Shawn Michaels match with his athleticism. This is need your balls. That's what you should look out for in the Shawn Michaels like match. Great basketball team. Just stick well, to the stomps. He gets going, Cole. Ric Flair is doing everything he can to prevent Shawn Michaels from Whatever. I was in the middle of a strike and he just gets a move out of nowhere. What an impact from that kick. Shawn Michaels is dug down deep. He's dug down like he has so many times over his career. Oh. He's got him hooked. The opportunistic Sit battle down. in the ring today. Nature oh. Boy Ric Flair, who's overcome it all. 16-time oh. world champion. Survived Flair flop. <laughs> Flair flopped on his body. Broken back. And not many people thought that Ric Flair would ever come back to WWE after that. But not only did he come back, he came back to Damn. dominate. Can you imagine coming back from Ball. a plane crash like the Nature Boy? That's not exactly a pulled hamstring. No, and that's just another one of the reasons that Rick yes, it's is this. an absolute The dirtiest player. WWE. Woo! The strut. The Ric Flair strut. Woo! Oh, this isn't good. Signature move. The one leg on atomic drop. Boom. Oh. He's out. Out. Oh, that's My balls. Come on, HBK. They're supposed to be like a, a devout Christian. You need, me, you need me my balls. What the hell? Oh, what an elbow drop. Thou shalt not ball stomp. Well, in the events leading up to this match, Shawn Michaels brought tears to Nature Boy's eyes. Oh, God. Oh! How he idolized Ric Flair. Dirtiest player. Ric Flair. But King Shawn eventually got stabbed in the back by Ric Flair. Wait a minute. As for Michaels being stabbed in the back, that was just typical Nature Boy. And uh. Shawn Michaels really idolized Flair like he said he did. 
He should have expected it. Yeah, you'd be okay with it. Oh, fuck him up. HPK should have seen it coming. Doesn't Choke him, Flair. Yes, the dirtiest player in the game. Choke his ass. All right, Irish will move into the corner and perform a figure for a leg lock. But Shawn Michaels in his place here tonight. Flair is just so confident. Some would say borderline arrogant, but boy, so confident. Well, believe me, Flair is arrogant. I want to do it in reverse. Who's the nature boy? The one thing Ric Flair wants to do here tonight is the gate, the speed, and quickness advantage that Shawn Michaels has over him, and it looks like he may be doing it. Well, even if Shawn I want to do it in reverse and faster than the Nature Boy, he'll never have the arsenal. I can't get out. Come on. Maybe he doesn't need that arsenal, King, as agile and athletic as Shawn Michaels is. Well, this isn't the first time these men have been in the Yes, no opportunity. It's the first time Rick Flair and Shawn Oh, that's too fast. Full of shit. I was going to do a signature move. Building to this king. Shawn Michaels and the Nature Boy run. Told you he's doing it. Six man tag team match at Backlash just a few months ago. And since then, no, gave up. things have gotten very ugly between them. Well, maybe things have gotten ugly between Rick Flair and Shawn Michaels since Backlash. But it was only the Nature Boy doing up. what he needed to do. You mean sucker punch? He reversed. Oh. Yeah, maybe it was something. Rick Flair needed to do. He reversed but again! Sure Every time I press a button, he fucking reverses. Reversed. A quick reversal by Rick Flair. Oh, what's All right, I got him, finally. Here. Holy shit. by Shawn Michaels, and ooh, Flair hit that corner hard. He's dazed. Yeah, really dazed. Here comes HBK. Oh, X. Flair in the corner. Nice. Shawn Michaels has him, but wait a minute. Referee, oh, look at that. oh, hit the low blow on both of them. And I think, I think Ric Flair got both HBK and the referee. Yes. What are you going to do now, Nature Boy? Woo. I'll show you what I'm going to do. Watch this. You can see him struggling to stand after all the damage he's taken. I'm trying to do the figure we'll four, but I don't have a fucking... Rick Flair don't let me do it. Move. The figure four leg lock becomes before the end of this match. When the Nature Boy uses effectively, it's been said that it puts severe pressure on seven different points of your legs. Well, let me tell you something, Cole. I felt it, and I hate it. I don't think oh. there's anything worse than the... I can't do a finisher yet. I gotta get the signature well, out of here. Except maybe for one of his chops. Hey, here it is. Figure four leg lock. Yes. Reverse. The ref gets bumped again. Oh, my God. How many ref bumps were there? And now Shawn Michaels is ready to go. Sweet chin music. Tune up the band for some sweet chin music on Nate. Look at out, Nature Boy. And he connects. Who the heck? Orton. Randy Orton. Yes. 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 The beginning of evolution. Here it is. Randy Orton. Member of evolution. Are you kidding the referee? His buddy Flair. And there's the. Yes. Woo! I can't believe this, Cole. No, I can't. Very nice. That's the way these guys operate. The Nature Boy, Ric Flair, is. He's almost unconscious. There's no way he could have won this match over Shawn Damn. Michaels without the help of Randy Orton. It's hard to believe this was 11 years ago. Seriously. Rick Flair can barely stand, but Shawn Michaels is out. Orton paid dividends. All right, well, Ric Flair wins the match. Evolution. In this ring is the greatest example of evolution. As the members of Triple H's new faction, Evolution, continued to grow, so did the problems for the Heartbreak Kid. Shawn Michaels is the next legend that I'm going to kill. It's legend versus the legend killer. Michaels going, oh, he's caught. Sweet chin music. Oh, what a swap to the RKO. And Orton wins it. The yes. Prevailed. Later that same Orton's night, beginning. Triple H's long title reign came to an end. In the weeks to come, the game would enlist an animal in an effort to reclaim his throne. That's Batista, the hell? Batista, something Shawn Michaels. HBK 
Kay's problems only became worse with the addition of the newest member of Evolution. Yes! At the 2003 Batista. Survivor Series, the animal would unleash his rage. We're down to Shawn Michaels and Randy Orton! Wait a minute! That animal! Batista! No! Look, Shawn. I powerbombed your ass! Straight to hell! Hey, just come on down, you jacked up Nimrod! Batista and <laughs> Freaking Batista, that's his debut, you know. Well, not really. His debut is Deacon Bautista. That was when Devon was supposed to be a preacher character, and he was his deacon going around collecting money and stuff. It was really stupid. So they ditched that after like four months, and then he became just B Batista, and he joined uh, Evolution. But here it is. The following contest is scheduled. 